M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So, if you are an existing owner of a Zygu G90, which is this radio here, or a Zygu 5105, they have made, and it's about a year ago really, they have made this item here, which is the G, let's get it right, Zygu GSOC Remote Controller Touchscreen Spectrum Waterfall Display. So you can basically control either of these radios, the G90 or the 5105, with this add-on. Now, if you look at the price in the UK, you know, you're talking about time it's delivered, about £340. I think that seems like a, a good price for what you get. You, it's touchscreen. Now, as I look at a video here, I saw it's a couple of videos. This one's from Con Connector 5000 PL. And you even get the decode. And then there's another video here from Robert Nagy. Much clearer. So I'll put these in the description so you can watch them. It, I think it looks good. So why am I even looking at this? Well, I've just got myself a Zygu 6100, and I can see how they've sort of used, um, you know, their hardware, software, uh, and uh, and created the X6100, which is basically like having one of these radios and this radio, but this is one's touchscreen, by the way, all in one box. I find that interesting, so I thought I'd put it on my channel. So uh, check it out now. It looks like there are firmware, you know, upgrades that you're going to need for. Let's have a look here, and they're all provided. Click here to to for the latest firmware. Not sure what the date is. I can't find much in the last six months. But anyway, check it out. And I think about Zygu, they are open to feedback. All of their, when they sell something, they always have a click here to leave your using feedback and suggestion. They're learning from ham radio operators all the time. Now this one, I know that the Bluetooth does work. They've got a section here, learn how to use Bluetooth. Um, the blue, so we're having problems at the moment with the, with the X6100 where uh, basically not the Bluetooth doesn't work basically um, um, and the wi well it, and the Wi-Fi so hopefully that they're gonna fix that the hardware's in there I can't see that there's any mention of, of the Wi-Fi in this GSOC uh, but I just for someone who may already own I know the 5105 was a very popular radio this might be an option for you I'm not recommending it I'm just saying I've seen it I'm interested in, in reading about it loads of info on all these products. Zygu, they are really trying and they're really, you know, far, far as I can see, trying to be a very good uh, company for ham radio. Um, and so, yeah, you decide what you think. But um, yeah, just check out this video. L look at the links. Watch Robert's video if you've already got one of those radios. And um, yeah, look at that. It looks good to me. Touch screen. So I'll say 7.3. My dog is um, wants to go for a walk. Um, there are reviews, older reviews, when this first came out, where there was a lot of bug problems, and I've watched them. Um, and so we'll watch them as well. 7.3, thanks for watching.